Have you ever tried to launch a media campaign and ended up buried in endless emails, spreadsheets, and waiting for replies that never come? Yeah, we've all been there. But what if you could do it all? Find publishers, place your content, and track results in just a few clicks. That's what MediaLister promises to do. Hi, I'm Daniel. Welcome to my channel, where I make smart tutorials. Today, we're checking out a platform that might just make media collaborations faster, smarter, and honestly, way less stressful. We'll start by exploring what MediaLister is and how it actually works. Then I'll show you how to browse media outlets, compare prices, and publish your first article. All from one simple dashboard. By the end of this video, you'll see how easy it can be to manage your media presence with just a few clicks. Also, I've left all the useful links in the description down below, so don't forget to check them out. So let's jump in and see what this AI powerhouse is all about. All right, my friends, so let's take a detailed look at the MediaLister platform, a modern marketplace for media placements. This platform is revolutionizing the way media owners and advertisers work together. MediaLister is a self-service platform with a global catalog of over 100,000 media outlets. It was designed to make the process of publishing content in the media simpler, transparent, predictable, and efficient. The platform works in both directions. For advertisers, marketers, and PR professionals, it's a tool for launching media campaigns with guaranteed placements, transparent prices, and clear publication deadlines. And what's great about it, guys, is that there's no need to send dozens of emails, negotiate prices, or wait endlessly for a reply. For media owners, it's an opportunity to monetize their audience by receiving publication requests from brands all over the world. You can add your website, blog, or online publication to the marketplace, set your own conditions and prices, and get a stable flow of clients. Everything happens in one convenient interface with a single control panel, a transparent payment system, and automated processes. Today, we'll look at the platform and see how to work with it. When we open the dashboard, we see a clean, minimalist design that displays our first campaigns and orders. It looks like a Kanban board with columns showing the stages of your publication's life cycle. Just to give you an overview, folks, the one title to publish is for articles ready for posting. The on review column shows materials being checked by publishers, and to make changes is for those that need revision. Finally, articles to approve are published pieces waiting for your final check, and published are the ones already live. Your article goes through several steps. First, you book a publishing slot in the media outlet recommended by MediaLister, or choose one yourself in the marketplace. Then you send the article text, wait until it's reviewed by the publisher, and approve the published version. Let's start with the first step and go to Marketplace Media to find suitable outlets for our SEO campaign. We click on the Media or Marketplace tab and see a full list of media outlets. This is the heart of the platform. There are more than 102,000 media resources available for cooperation, which is truly impressive. We can also use filters to narrow the selection by language, category, media type, audience metrics, or price. For example, our articles can be LLM friendly or localized for a specific country. We can sort outlets by price, audience, or country. It's also possible to filter by turnaround time, hyperlinks, accepted topics, and other conditions. The filtering system is powerful and flexible. After sorting, we can open a media card and see its options. And here, my friends, we can check which outlets fit our goals. For example, we can compare prices, formats, and the number of visitors. We can open the site itself, view recent posts, and make sure it's active and regularly updated. Then we can decide what suits us best, a contributor post or a mention. Let's say I choose a contributor post. Opening the media list or checkout, I can look at examples, check the turnaround time, and accepted topics. I can also see visitor charts and engagement metrics. Another thing I can do is review SEO data to decide whether to buy it or not. If I compare two platforms, for example, Kaggle and PSPL.com, I can see that the latter has recently grown, but the former still seems the better option. Guys, let me take a little break to ask you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. It's absolutely free, but helps me make even more fun tutorials for you. Thanks. I add it to the cart and subscribe to the platform. After checking my balance, I click book. And now I'm subscribed to Kaggle. Next, I can provide the article for publication. I write the article, choose a topic, 
and make sure it fits the Kaggle audience, a global community of data scientists and machine learning engineers. I add the article text to the editor and divide it into sections. I can manage the publish date or simply send it for review. There's also a chat to communicate with the company. Once I send the article, its status changes to on review. After the Kaggle team checks whether it fits their topic and content policy, it may move to make changes or articles to approve. And all I have to do now is just wait, guys. Or I can write another article and apply it to a different media outlet. And that's not all. I can also register on Medialister as a publisher and receive offers for my own blog. In this way, I can accept requests from other platforms and publish them on my site. So I can act both as a client and as a publisher within the same platform. All right, my friends, that's a wrap for today. Medialister isn't just another tool. It's a smarter way to connect brands and publishers without all the usual stress. If you're planning your next PR campaign, or looking to monetize your own media outlet, this platform keeps everything simple, transparent, and efficient. If you have ever wished media collaborations were faster and easier, Medialister is exactly what you need. Take full control of your campaigns, boost your brand visibility, and enjoy guaranteed placements with clear timelines. So what do you think? Would you try running your next campaign this way? If you're excited to try it out, or if you've already used it and have some thoughts to share, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your experiences. Don't forget to hit that like button if you found this video helpful and subscribe for more tutorials. Thanks for watching and till next time.